Chief Judge, you came out in a statement and you were very direct in your uh, thinking about what is going on in River State. Um, can you speak to what you said in your statement in respect of uh, the kind of violence that we're seeing in River State today? Yeah. Uh, thank you for uh, inviting me, uh, Sean. You know, as an elder of our person, if there are issues placating or emanating from within the system, it is the responsibility of the Board of Trustees of our party to be the elders in the room to calm the nerves. Um, I was shocked, you know, when I started reading all sorts of things and uh, and then culminated in this final burning of uh, properties of the government. Um, I want to appeal to all sides. This is the time to cool off. The economic situation in Nigeria is in dire straits. And to now conflagrate the properties of River State government, you know, also calls for everybody to have an attention. You know, what, what drove me to write where my appeal to the president, to Fubara, UK was, I was in secondary school between 1960 and 1964. We witnessed in Western region, the whole Western region, we witnessed the way this crisis started. It was an election that was held. The, the election was manipulated and it led to all kinds of uh, unbelievable situations. That was the beginning of Adekoya because the farmers in the whole of Western region at that time came out in support of action group. But before we knew it, we were in high school. I was in form four, form three. Yeah. At that time, we had, we had to go out to town to go and fetch water. That was by, you know, as students, we saw what was going on. And we, I have prayed that that kind of thing will should never again happen in Nigeria. So as they were driving and situations were going in this, in this direction, I said, look, Mr. President, call your minister to order, call the police to order, uh, Governor Fubara, please take full control of the state. Because, you see, it normally starts in this little form. And I am happy that uh, the police now has decided that they are now going to now jump in and ensure that there is security of life and property. Because who, who, who creates that? The first responsibility of any government is to provide security of lives and property in their states. And the way it was going, the way it was, if nothing is done, that is the cash cow. That yes, is the, the, the number one uh, income for this country.